And we bought a complete Ewok village for a hundred bucks. Uh, amazing seller in there. Very, very cool. It's bigger than Space Buns is. Don't drop it. ICCC, round three. Fight! Let's go, I'm tired. I'm kind of all conned out. Uh, I've spent like $1,800, which isn't a lot in the grand scheme of things. It's more than I plan to. Uh, I got my live podcast today at noon. Going in now, I might buy a Slave Leia, orange card, orange card, listen to me, orange box Slave Leia. But we'll see, there's a lot of people here already on Sunday. Let's go inside. All right, guys, we just got done interviewing Flynn. We're going to go up on stage here soon. We're going to bring him with us yes. over here. Space Buns is getting a shirt. I don't know what's going on over here. It's been a wild con so far. We're excited. We're going to be up on stage very soon. Tune in. Behind the scenes, about to go live. We've got Flynn. We've got Space Buns. We've got Sleeping. Can I get one you guys Ready. take a picture? Because my selfie thing. skills suck. <laughs> my arms aren't long enough. I'm a wee man. Let's go. Okay, are you ready? Boom! Pizza and alligator grease. See you later, alligator. Bye-bye. <laughs> this convention's been so much fun. We just did that amazing stage show. It was incredible. Shout out to my man Flynn Hendricks. We just bought a new walk village from this vendor over here. There's just tons of stuff everywhere, and it's all amazing. And my wallet hurts, but my heart is full. And with that, I'm getting out of ICCC 2022 and heading home. We have a 10 hour drive home. It's gonna be a while before we get there. Probably stop at a lot of targets on the way. You know how we do here at Sleeping Collectibles. Take it all in one last second, guys. ICCC 2022, thanks for having us. Let's go. All right, we are on the road home. We're stopping at Walmart here, I don't know, somewhere before Knoxville, Tennessee. We're gonna go in and get some libations for the road, maybe a toy or two, we'll see what they got. Let's go. All right, we found the Funko collectible section here at Walmart. There's a bunch of Fina Funkos here. There's also some Gilgameshes. Gilgamesh is one of those ones that might have a chase. So we're definitely gonna look. Don't know that we'll find one. Maybe we'll get lucky. You guys knew the deal. It's very hit or miss with Funko. Nope, doesn't look like we're finding a glow in the dark Gilgamesh chase today. That's all right, that's not one we need anyway. Down here, got Halloween, got King Kong, got our Goliath, got our Aang, Funko restock down here, La Casa de Papel, I have not seen those pops ever before in my life. Got King George, got Hamilton, got our director popper, Pan Am, some office space, got some Sun Gokus, we'll definitely scan those, see how much they ring up. Sometimes these ring up 10 bucks and we like that. Uh, don't see too much going on. Otherwise, got a biggie, got our hopper on clearance for $50. Hard pass. Got some hard stacks, some Boba Fetts. Nothing that I'm crazy about. Let's keep looking. Let's see what else we can come across in here. All right, guys, action figure aisle right here. Transformers Legacy. Got some wrestling over here. Back and forth. Nia Jax for 16 Not too shabby. Got a bunch of WWE Elites. One blue Cody Rhodes hanging up. I don't see any more AEW. There's more WWE Elites up there. Uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. They have a full stack of DC. What do we got over here in G.I. Joe, actually? Eh, it looks like the normal peg warmers. Nothing too crazy for Joes. Marvel Legends is dead. Just a Doctor Strange hanging up. Do have our Wally West Flash. Have our Anti-Crisis Wonder Woman. Some new DC. Got our Jace Batman up there. With ink. Looks like we're getting some new DC Multiverse stuff, so that's kind of cool. Some Lonely Landos hanging up. I don't see anything else over here. Just Lando. And, of course, we have some Pokemon. Have some Sword and Shield, some Vivid Voltage, some Darkness Ablaze. Do have a Mewtwo V Union box. It's kind of cool to see. Some Lunch Boxes, some Fortnite. And, honestly, that's it. There's not much happening. Some Wild Space Buns. Hey, I saw the Nia on clearance. Is Carmella also on clearance? No, no, I don't know. No. I would take Carmella if she was on clearance, but she is not, so we must leave her. All right, let's get out of here, guys. I'll see you the next stop. All right, guys, we're in Knoxville, Tennessee. We just went to Ross, and there wasn't really anything there. But now we're at Target. Bougie Super Target, Nashville. I guess not Nashville, Knoxville. It's been a long weekend, guys. Forgive me. I'm going in. We're looking for toys. It's pretty big. I'm all right with it. 
Let's go see if they have that ultimate Batista I've been looking for. That's the big one on my list right now for Target. So we'll see. Let's go. All right, guys, we got a toy section. Let's see what's up. All right, moving on down. Got some land sharks here. Those are on clearance. Ooh. Do we have a Batista ultimate? We do not. We would Alexa Bliss ultimate. Got Miro, Ortiz, Santana, Frankie, Master Universe 3, 1359, Savage E-Man. There are a ton of children in here today. Holy sweet Jeebus. Uh, nothing I really need. Some dinos. Dinos are cool, but I'm not here for dinos. Unless it's a Brachio boy. Got our mass Multiverse of Madness. DC Land. He's got some scattered DC stuff. Uh, Drowned. It's tightened. There's armored soups. Let's scan this and see if it's ringing up cheaper. We might get it if it's on sale. But I don't see too much else, guys. Do see uh, Optimus Prime down here. Got some Rekgar, some Sweet. Nothing that I really need, though. I was really hoping to find that Batista. Angel Garza, Hurricane, hanging out up there. Uh, let's wander about, see what's going on. Nothing. All right, I'm going to slide over NECA collectibles. We'll see if there's anything over there. All right, guys, we're going in. What was that? 30% off Funko Pop toys. 30% off Pops? What? Go ahead. You're okay. 30% off Pops definitely makes me want to pick up one or two. All right, we're back. I don't see much. We have 30% off, though, which is nice. But there's really not anything there. Looks like a lot of uh, business as usual. Do have some gun plickets over here. We got Trick Freedom. We got Sky Zero. That's really cool. I've not seen that one before. Other than that, I think this target's pretty beat, guys. We are probably going to bounce and head on over to Walmart. Maybe another Target, even. Kind of want to find this Batista before I head home. We'll see. I'll take you guys with me. You know I always do. There's a random pillar of Funko Pop in the middle of the floor. Looks like all common stuff, though. Like nothing worth grabbing at all. G.I. Joe hanging out over here. Got a Baroness. Got a Coraline. Land Shark. Vespa Lego. Nothing we need. All right, moving on, guys. I'll see you the next stop. That target was awful. However, we've got a new target to wash the taste of that target out of our mouth. We're in Knoxville, Tennessee. Space buns and me. Let's go get some toys. I'm tired of rhyming. I think I'm just tired. I'm gonna like pay someone to start cutting promos. I'm sleepy. Collectibles. All right, guys. No dinos. I hope this is the right section. Well, let's go. There's a guy down there. I need to get in that aisle, sir. Let's uh, fast forward a little bit. Ooh, got a little clearance section here. Six dollar Marvel Legends. We like to see that. Oh, oh, let's... The gentleman is in my spot. Not a fan. Looks like I gotta wait my turn. Hang on. All right, dipping in Marvel Legends land. Got a ton of crow. Crow on clearance for twenty-two dollars. That's kind of fun. Got a bunch of Wongs, America Chavez. Got our bat bike. Got our drifter. Got our soups. Soups build a figure for 17. That's a pretty good deal. We'll take that. Armored Batman down there. Joker Titan. Uh, same Transformers that are at every store. Optimus. Blaster and Eject. Got our dinos right here. Had a man over in my wrestling section a minute ago, so. He walked away with nothing, so I assume that I am walking away with nothing as well. Do see some Lay Archive, some Scouty Boys. Uh, look at that, 1854 on sale. Get them while you can, guys. Austin Theory, we got some Santana, Santana. Road Dog, China, Drew, Mean Mark. All right. Got some Faker, got some Tupac down there. Do a Fisto, Skeletor, Skelly God, or got a Mirrorverse. Yeah, there's not too, too much here. Let's uh, wander around. Let's keep looking. We might find something. You, you never know these kind of places. You just never know. Never, ever, ever, ever know. Let's walk over to NECA Collectibles and see what's going on over there. All right, we are over here. We got Mew hanging out. Bunch of pop pins. Some Stranger Things. We got Saigor. Inigo Montoya. We have our Vox Machina, our Princess Bride. Uh, some dinosaurs, some Zilla. 
a whole bunch of Do Not Destroy pack away boxes, some X Men domes. I don't honestly see much. Not at all, really. Alright, I'm gonna wander around a bit and have a look and see if I can't dredge up some kind of win. And I'll touch base with you guys in a minute. Hang on. One last stop before we go home. We've been kind of taking our sweet time this entire trip. We've been gone like five hours from the con and we've only made it like two hours down the road. We've spent way too much time shopping, so this will probably be our last stop for a while. We're at Walmart, Knoxville, Tennessee. Gonna go and look for Thor, Love and Thunder. Gonna look for Funko. Gonna look for Clearance. Whatever we find. Look for snacks. Snacks too. Definitely need those. Then we're gonna grab some Zach's beef and probably hit the road for four or five hours to put a big dent in this trip. Cause I'd like to go home before it gets dark and I'm losing daylight quick. So uh, let's get started. Space Buns has found the Funko Pops. Is there anything good here? No. No, it doesn't look like it. There are some Gilga meshes up here. You have to check those sometimes because sometimes there'll be a Chase Gilgi mixed in. It's not worth much, but you know, sometimes you like to find a Chase every now and again. If I get the camera on that, that would help. The Mummy, it's mm -hmm. a good one. They have Frankenstein. It's the Karloff Mummy. I don't really see too much here. This is kind of a rough little collectible section. Do you like the Stranger Things shirt? That's cool. Yeah, let's get over to action figures. This is bringing me down. There was a little end cap right here. More, another Karloff mummy. Some marshmallows. Do you have the farm two pack? That's kind of cool to see. Mm -hmm. But not much else. The mole people. The mole people. I live with a mole person. Oh, whoops. Let's go. Moving on. All right, we are dropping in. See a lot of movie Joes. Those are gonna sit forever, especially at $17. It's too much, too much. Down here, Marvel Land. I see no Love and Thunder, but I do see Multiverse of Madness. All the way down the line. Another Joker Titan right here. Got some DC stuff, some Flash. Uh, over here in wrestling, we got a full AEW set. Let's see what we got. Some Nyla Rose, Nick Jackson, we got Frankie Frankie. We got Dax, we got Cash, they're always hanging out together. Sheeta, ooh, 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 definitely just murdered that, uh, oof. Sorry, Dax, I'll put some respect on the top guy's name. Yeah, there's nothing here, though. Lots and lots of commons. Mochi Revelation's pretty dead. Pokemon's got a little bit, Minecraft's got a little bit. Star Wars has Landos. And that's it. Looks like a bust, guys. All right. Get out, keep moving. We got a long drive ahead of us. What's up guys? Finally home. We got home last night at three in the morning. It's like 3.20. I went to bed at four, woke up at eight. Couldn't sleep. I think I've got the con crud. I feel like I'm dying. But I did want to show you guys this massive haul I got for the week. It's probably the biggest haul I've ever gotten. I'm here in my kitchen and uh, I'm just blown away by the amount of stuff I bought. So we're gonna go over everything. I'll show you guys what's going on. My wallet hurts. I think I might be done buying for a week or so. We'll see. Uh, let's go over it. All right, first things first, we picked up that Land Shark on clearance for $9. Easy grab. We also got both of these Jokers for $6 each from Target. Six bucks, can't pass that up. Picked up an Arc Trooper from the con, the Walmart exclusive Arc Trooper. Picked up this Bruce Lee on clearance at Walgreens for $6. Easy grab. Also got one of those Megatron statues on clearance for $13.99. Absolutely needed this to match the Optimus Prime I got. Grabbed a big Bulby boy from GameStop. I like Pokemon. I like Bulbasaur. Easy grab for me. Picked up a, a cane on clearance at Target for $19. Another Ultimate Cane. Uh, so we get to hold on to for a little while. At the con, we grabbed a bunch of Power of the Force goodies. Uh, I picked up a Qui-Gon, a Greedo, a Stormtrooper. Just uh, some Power of the Force fodder. Also grabbed this... Uh, Ray Starkiller base figure I'm going to put together with Kylo. Now we get into the meat and potatoes of the matter. Oof. All of this gloriousness. Uh, picked up some Black Series at Target on one of our Target runs. At the con, we also grabbed the Scout Trooper Grogu Amazon exclusive Black Series. We got our Boba Fett orange line. Picked up a Count Dooku uh, Clone Wars figure. We got our giant Obi-Wan Sideshow Mythos statue. I'm very excited to crack that open. Also picked up a Bakugo My Hero Academia t-shirt pop tea combo. Got that Mankind Funko lunchbox with a pop and all kinds of goodies in there. We met 
Ahsoka Tano herself, Ashley Eckstein, and we had her sign our Clone Wars figure. Two sleeping collectibles. Very, very sweet. Got that Ultimate Alexa Bliss. We snatched up three packets of Muppet Lego minifigures. Got ourselves a Kate Bishop Funko Pop. Got our Asajj Ventress Clone Wars figure. Did grab two more Eternals for $6 each. Just want to finish that lineup. We've got ourselves a Chase Edge WWE Legends figure. We've got Slave Leia Orange Line. Look at my girl. Woo. Good pickup. Good pickup. For Space Buns, we got ourselves a Bam Presto Sailor Moon statue. Picked up that NWO Funko 3-pack. We picked up a General Grievous six-scale sideshow piece. Very, very awesome. I can't wait to unbox these two. And, as you saw in the video, we picked up a complete Ewok Village action playset in box, complete, for $100. Absolute must pick up. Such a good price. Needed to have. Came home with me. And, well, that's not everything either. I also picked up a Loki Alligator Funko Pop as well that's still in the car. So I do have another Funko Pop that I picked up at the con. And a bunch of other little odds and ends. Look at that. Look at this whole haul. From bottom to top. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Also, shout out to Big Dub. To Dub himself. Who bought Natalie the Sailor Moon lightsaber. Uh, the guy at the lightsaber booth also threw in a lightsaber for Space Buns as well. So, very cool. Um, it's a little purple thing. She digs it a lot. We're going to display it up in her room. I might end up buying her a Sailor Moon lightsaber this week as well. We will see. We'll, we'll see how funds look after everything clears. Because we did some damage this week, guys. Thank you guys for hanging out for all four days of the ICCC sleepover video series. You guys are wonderful. I appreciate each and every one of you. You guys know the deal, though. I'm tired. I gotta go mow my grass. Uh, I'll see you guys soon. Until next time, good night. Sleep tight. I hope all your collecting dreams come true. Later days. Wait, 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 wait. Before we end this video, I forgot some stuff. I also picked up a vintage Chewy, uh, just a loose plate with one uh, to hang out. I also grabbed this R2 boy. Needed this R2 for the collection. I don't know where Chewie is. He's in one of the bags that might not have gotten unpacked yet. There might be more that I bought that I forgot about. Because I know I can't find Chewie and he's here somewhere. We did get an R2 though. Stickers have seen better days, but you know how it works with that kind of stuff. Pick that up. Also, we picked up a copy of Timothy Zahn's Thrawn. And we got it signed by Tim. Really nice guy. Uh, very cool experience. Highly recommend it. Go read Thrawn. Go get it signed by Tim. Go pay money to him. Go. Later days.